agriculture is a biological process where we take tissue from plants and we transfer them into in vitro and we let allow them to grow. It's basically propagation but at the micro level, sometimes referred to as micropropagation. It's a way to produce a larger number of plants in a shorter time frame. Two, you get identical plants or the parent plant. So let's say for instance, we had one plant that we want to produce multiple plants of and we want to do that exact species and variation. We use tissue culture to get that exact plant. And then for three, for quality reasons, a tissue culture plant is bacteria free because it has to grow under sterile conditions. It is bacteria free, so you have a healthier plant. The three main steps are initiation, multiplication, and root formation. Initiation, it starts from the outside. So we have plants on the outside, and these plants obviously have microorganisms from the outside. So these plants are treated, and then they're brought into our preparation room. We take parts of the plant, X plants, and we either take the leaves or the stem, and we treat them. We treat them chemically using 10% bleach or surgical alcohol to clean them, all done in our preparation room. We move from the preparation room into the transfer room on the laminar flow. On the laminar flow, we cut up these plants into small fragments, tissue, to get the tissue, using either the leaves or the stems, and we place them in tubes already sterilized, and we place them on the media. This media has all the nutrients and hormones needed for growth and development. After that stage, we will bring them into the transfer room and they stay for four to six weeks for growth. Then we move to the multiplication stage. The multiplication stage is where we take this same one plant and we carry it back on the laminar floor and we cut it into smaller plants. So one plant can produce say, five more plants and let's say that's in four to six weeks. So if we start with 100 plants, in four to six weeks we end up with 500 plants. In root farming season, we take these plants back on the laminar floor and place them in a new media, a media with special hormones specifically for rooting purposes. Then we allow them to we bring them back to the growth room to grow, and this is where roots farm, and we now have our new plantlets. Where afterwards, we remove the plants from in the lab and we take them to the greenhouse. We have our customers demanding say they want a hundred chrysanthemums or a thousand chrysanthemums we specifically will work with the chrysanthemums so it's basically about demand and supply it will also benefit the public because when they have tissue culture plants they know that their plants are disease free in the future we're planning to Broadly variety, whether it be local or international. So if um, a customer decides that they want this particular variety, if we have it at the commission, we would work with it. If we don't have it, we would bring it in, introduce it, and then we will work from there.